You all right? No, I'm terrified I'm gonna inadvertently kill your sister and you're gonna hate me. Episode 109 is a really exciting one for me. I wrote it with Eva McKenna and it was directed by Sherry Appleby, who is obviously the original Liz from the 1999 TV show. Uh, when she heard about Roswell, New Mexico, she did an interview and said that she would love it if we called her and asked her to direct. Yeah. So I called her and asked her to direct. Yes, right. um, and man, what an honor it was to have her with us. I mean, she was so cool, told us lots of gossip about the original show that we'll never share. Um, but I mean, she was wearing her old Roswell High t-shirts on set every day, and it was just incredible. We haven't given up on you, Isabel. We never will. When we start this episode, Max is in a really low place. His sister is in a pod. That's the person who's the most important person in his entire life. And he has been searching for answers about this symbol on his back. And this symbol has been integrated into the logo for a healer out in Texas. Yep. Are you following me? No. I try to stay upwind of you, Garen. Maria is in search of a cure for what ails her mother, and they believe that a faith healer in Texas might be the answer. Think she's like us? We're not the only three who survived the crash? No, but it's not impossible. But maybe there were more pods, or she came in a different ship. They get the first inkling in wondering if they are actually alone, and that is both hopeful and terrifying to them. You said this symbol might be a beacon. Let's heed the call. We don't know what this symbol yeah. is. I know it's... It's my tattoo, it's pretty cool, but mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I, why? That symbol is connected to my family and my past. I need to know more about my past in order to make sure my sister has a future. Mm -hmm.